is your Corsair power supply recall? Hi, Chris here for Tech and welcome to the channel. Want to find out more? So, let's get started now. Let's make it clear. This is a voluntary recall from Corsair. It's not false. You can if you want to. The recall, as the title says, is for the SF series, especially the one who was produced in between October 29 2019 and March 2020. It is good to note that if you purchase a pre-built system during this period, you may be affected as well. So you may want to check for the serial number. And when I say pre-built, this is about the Corsair one, you may be affected as well. You have first, as I did say, check for the serial number that you can find on the power supply itself. As you can see here, I also link the article, so feel free to double check in the description down below, where there will also be a link for, as you can see here, for the request form. You have to note, however, that it's in English only. I don't know why they did else like that, but uh, this is what it is. How they find out about it, it's very simple. They notice an increase in RNA from the SF series, so they started an investigation. And this investigation led to find out about some of the units are prone to fail if they are subject to high humidities and high temperature. But this is only to the primary side, which means they won't affect the inner component to your computer as the secondary side, which deliver the power to your component, is not affected. Now, if you want to check the lockup range to see if this applies to you, you can check here above and make or simply follow the link in the descriptions and check for yourself. According to Corsair, and what they say is they will try their best to replace any unit to fail in between those codes. To find out more, just follow the link in the description below. Please do leave a comment. It would be nice to know if uh, you are affected or not. Mine, I bought it before. I hope it's the case for you also. It's very nice of Corsair to do uh, such a thing and not wait until a lot of people complain. This video reached at the end. I do hope uh, it was useful to you. You can now do your YouTube things as press the like button, may you want to. You can also subscribe if you like and press the bell button like this. You will be notified every time I post a new video. However, if you do not like it, simply leave a comment and tell me why you do not like it. That's about it for today. Stay safe, guys. Bye now.